avoid saying the same thing as me. If you have the same answers as me, then you're out of the game. Anyways, number one, uh, name a popular social media app. My answer is Instagram. Number two, name a dog breed. I went with Bulldog. Uh, number three, uh, name a color from the rainbow. I'm probably going to get a few people out. And my answer is green. Uh, number four, name a fruit. Any fruit. Any fruit you like. Um, but my answer is a banana. Um, if you made it this far, uh, give this video a like. Uh, give us a follow for more content like this. Uh, if you haven't already, go like my, uh, my recent videos that I've uh, posted. Um, anyways, number five. I'm going to take a lot of people off with this question. Um, yeah, I'm going to get a lot of people out with this. Anyways, pick a number between one to five. I wish you good luck. But uh, I went with four. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me? Extreme edition. You guys wanted to make it harder, so here's my hardest one yet. As always, if you say the same thing as me, you lose, you're out. Starting with question number one, name any country that starts with the letter L. There's only a couple of them, so don't get out. My country was Lithuania. If I got you on Lithuania, I'm sorry, but you're out on the first question. Next one is name any color from the rainbow. There's slim pickings on these guys. My color is blue. If you got blue, I'm sorry, but you're out. Next is going to be name a music genre. Once again, slim pickings here, guys. I said country. Next, what day of the week do you think? Hmm. What one am I thinking of? Don't mess it up. Well, if you said Monday, you messed it up, get out of here. And last but not least, this one's hard, guys. Give me a number one through five. Any number one through five. If you said four, though, you're out of here. Sorry, man. Thanks for participating. Let me know how you guys did in the comments, and I'll see you next time. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me? If you say the same thing, you are out. And you guys told me to make this harder, so we've made it harder. And hopefully I can catch a few of you guys out. Okay, round number one. Just think of any fruit. Any fruit in the whole entire world. Which one are you going to think of? I'm thinking of pineapple. If you said pineapple, you are out. Round number two. I want you to think of any SpongeBob SquarePants character. It's as simple as that. There's loads of them. Surely you can't think of the same one as me. I'm thinking of Mr. Krabs. If you said Mr. Krabs, you are out. Round number three. Any country beginning with C. There's quite a few of these as well, but I feel like I'm going to catch a few of you guys out here. We're going with Canada. If you said Canada, you are out. Round number four, and if you got this far, very, very good effort. I just want you to name me any video game, any video game of all time. I'm going with GTA, Grand Theft Auto. If you said Grand Theft Auto, you are out. And finally, I just want you to name me any song by Michael Jackson. And the one I'm thinking of is Billy Jean. If you said Billy Jean, you are out. Let me know how you did in the comments. Try not to pick the same answers as me, Bible edition. If you choose any of the answers that I list for these questions that I ask, you are out. First question, name me a book of the Bible that starts with the letter H. There's not a lot of them, so I'm fairly sure I'm going to get a good amount of you out with this one. If you chose Hosea, you are out. Next, name me somebody in the Bible, no matter how significant or insignificant they may seem, that starts, the name, that their name starts with the letter J. Who am I going to pick? It's a good amount of people. If you said Job, you are out. Now, list me. A book of the Bible that begins with the letter C, as in cookie. It should be a good one. It's a, it's a fair amount, but I still feel like I'm going to get a decent amount of y'all with this one. If you choose Colossians, you are out. 
Last but certainly not least, don't get me wrong, we're not under the old covenant, but I'm still going to ask this question. Name me one of the Ten Commandments. Pick your favorite. Don't let me get any of y'all out with this one. Because I, I know I'm going to get a good amount of people with this one. If you said, thou shalt not kill, you are out. Let me know if y'all still want more of these. I'm having fun. Avoid saying the same thing as me, movie edition. That's right, I'm jumping on it. And we're starting with an MCU movie. What else would we start with? Don't think too much about it. There's so many. Your basic, The Avengers. I've got you already. I've got you already. You're out. You're out. Next up, an actress called Jennifer. There's loads. Aniston. Connolly. But we're going with the goat Jennifer Lawrence. It's too easy. It's too easy. We're going for a war movie. There's loads to choose from. Loads of great ones. What are you going to go for? You're going for Dunkirk because you haven't seen movies before the 2010s. I've got you again. A best picture winner. Again, so many. But my logic stands. Parasite. Parasite. Come on, guys. You can do better. Somebody in the Dune Part 2 cast. Really great cast. So many great actors there. I'm going for Austin Butler. I, I would go Austin Butler. I think you should all go Austin Butler. That's a good one to go out for. It's Austin Butler. And finally, a Jedi. One from the prequels. Originals. Maybe even the sequels. What about someone in all three? No, I wouldn't do that. Yoda. It's Yoda. Let me know in the comments if you survived. Try to avoid saying the same thing as me. Christian edition. Number one. Name a king in the Bible. If it said King Solomon, you're out. Question number two. Name one animal that was on the ark. If you said a lion, you're out. Question number three. Name one of Jesus' disciples. If you said Matthew, you're out of here. Question number four. And I'm going to narrow it down for this one. Name one of the four books of the gospel. If you said Luke, you're out of here. Last but not least, number five. Name one of the many, many miracles Jesus performed. I'll give you a second. If you said raised Lazarus from the dead, I'm sorry, but you're out of here. Did you get through all five? Let me know. This is Don't Say the Same Thing as Me, but Girl Edition. So you have to give a different answer to me for all five of the questions. And if you do that, then you win. Okay, let's go. Something to say to avoid giving a guy your number. You gotta think outside the box. Are you ready? Mine is, I'm a lesbian. So if you said that, you're out. Sorry. Next question. Something you comment on your friend's Instagram post. You do actually have to be broad with this because mine's a basic bitch answer, so. If you say this, you're a basic bitch. Sorry. Mine is slay queen. Please tell me you didn't say that. I hope you didn't. Okay, next one. You cuddle up on the sofa to watch a film. What are you drinking? I'll give you a minute to think. Mine is wine. So hopefully you said orange juice or coke your friends come over for a movie night what film are you watching this is my favorite film that i put for my answer but it is a bit of a basic bitch film so i'll give you a second think of something new mine's twilight obviously <laughs> um think of a male singer from your childhood okay now this one is hard because one person comes to mind i don't say it are you ready Mine is Justin Bieber. So if you got all of those correct, let me know down below in the comments. And if you want another one, I'll do them because it's actually, this is really fun. Avoid saying the same thing as me, movie edition part two. Too many of you survived part one. I'm going to get you this time, but we're starting off easy, nice and easy with any Pixar character. There's loads to choose from, but I feel like I'm in your head off the bat. ka -chow, Lightning McQueen. Goodbye. Next up, a Wes Anderson movie. Again, there's a good few. 
but I know how this works. I know. Recency bias. Asteroid City. If you said one of the shorts, fair play. Fair play. An actress called Rachel. There's lots of good ones. There's, but there is one. There is one. It's the Queen Rachel McAdams. If you said Rachel Senna or Zegler, a lot of respect for you. A movie with Margot Robbie in. Again, will the logic stand? You know what? Guys, think. There's an obvious one. Don't do it. Psych. Do it. I'm going Babylon. If you went Barbie, well done. Bravery pays off here. A live action Disney movie. Hmm. Difficult. Can you think of one? The Lion King. The Lion King. I'm sorry, I went obvious there. I couldn't keep playing you. And finally, a sports movie. Rocky. Creed. Remember the Tysons? But no, we're going for Moneyball. Let me know in the comments if you survived. Try not to pick the same answer as me. But besides Jesus and God, name a name that is used to refer to God or Jesus in the Bible, like in any of the versions, whether it's Hebrew, you know, any type of ways. If you chose Yahweh, you are out. Next question. Name a city that is mentioned in the Bible, Old or New Testament. I'll give you a little bit of time to think about it. If you chose Jerusalem, you are out. Next question. Name a book. Excuse me. Yeah. Name a book that's in the Old Testament. If you choose Deuteronomy, you are out. Last but most certainly not least, name a book of the New Testament. Why not? If you choose... Acts of the Apostles. You are out. Let me know if you have one more. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me? Except I get to say three things. You only get to say one. Let's start. Name a woman. Any woman. Anyone that's ever existed. Go. Okay. <laughs> I said Tara Yummy, Michelle Obama, and Francis Perkins, the creator of Social Security. So if you said those, you're out. Moving on. Next round. Name a video game. Any video game. Okay, time. If you said Fortnite, Valorant, or Spider-Man 2002 released on PS2 and Xbox, you're out. Moving on. Name a fruit. Any fruit. All right. If you said banana, dragon fruit, or lychee, I'm sorry, but you're done. Moving on. Name a movie. Any movie. All right. If you said Interstellar, Fight Club, or Barbie, you're done. Last round. Last round. Let's see who's got it. Name one letter of the alphabet. One. That's where I might throw you guys off. Just one letter. You locked in? I said A. Z and J. Did I get you or did you get me like for a part two? Try not to say the same answer as me, Bible edition. Name a woman from the Bible. I'm gonna give y'all a second to think about it. If you said Eve, you are out. Name a C from the Bible. You got another second to think about it. If you said Jerusalem, you are out the game. Give a nickname for God. And if you said Jehovah Jireh, you are out. And lastly, give one miracle performed in the Bible. If you said um, the woman with the issue of blood, you are out of the game. Try and avoid saying the same answer as me. I'm going to read you all five questions. All you've got to do is say an answer to each one. If your answer is different to mine on all five, then you win. Let's go. Question number one. Name me any board game. Give you a few seconds. And if you said Monopoly, then you're out on question number one. Question two. Name me any country beginning with the letter B. Three, two, one, Burkina Faso. 
Next up, name me any female singer. Taylor Swift. Adios. Goodbye. Question four. Name me any car brands. If you said Sayat, then au revoir. And last but not least, name me any US state. There's 50. Just choose one of them. If your chosen state was Louisiana, then you have lost and you are out the game. Did you win? Did you fail? Let me know in the comments down below. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me, Disney edition? If at any point during this video, your answer is the same as mine, you are out. I'm gonna go through five different categories, try to stay alive. Number one, name a ride or attraction in Disneyland. Any ride, and yes, it has to be Disneyland, not Walt Disney World. I'll give you a few seconds in between these to think about it. You got it? My answer is Space Mountain. Number two, name a Pixar movie. Good list to choose from. Mine is The Incredibles. Number three, name a Disney snack. Any snack you would find in a Disney park. Hopefully you did not pick Dole Whip because that's my answer. Number four, name a Disney princess. Yes, this princess does technically have to be Disney. You got it? My answer is Ariel. If you made it this far, congratulations. Hopefully you survived this last one. Number five, choose a Sensational Six character. That's any character from the options below. Did you pick one? If you did not select Goofy, which is my answer, you have made it out alive. Congrats and comment if you got through it. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me? And if you say the same thing, you are out. Round one, let's begin. Name a sport that doesn't require any skill at all. I think a lot of you guys are gonna get out on this one because there's just one sport that comes to mind for me and that's gotta be baseball. You just stand there with a stick and hit a ball or throw a ball. No real conditioning, no real skill. Round two, name an overhyped celebrity. I mean, I feel like a lot of celebrities get really lucky with their careers. And for me, I think Jacob Elordi gets way too much hype. I mean, bro is just tall, let's be real. If you're still in, I'm surprised because I've had some agreeable answers. But we're going to go to round three now. Name an underrated fast food restaurant, like somewhere that you can go, but everyone talks crap about it, but like it's always good. And I gotta, I gotta say, Wendy's never, never ceases to amaze me. Round four. Name an ugly shoe brand. I mean, back when I was a kid, there was just one brand that I would wear every single day. I thought it was so good. And looking back at it now, not the move. My pick is Vans. Now, that I think was a big cut for most of you guys, but if you're still in it, Round five is gonna be the toughest one yet. I mean, we're all gonna say the same word. Name any dinosaur species, okay? Three, two, one, Velociraptor, boom. I win, you lose, get wrecked. Avoid saying the same thing as me, YouTuber edition. I've been seeing this trend lately and I think it's really cool. There are five questions, they start broad, and then they end a little more specific. And as long as you don't say any of the people that I say, you're good. Okay, first, easy. Name a YouTuber. First YouTuber that pops in your head. And as long as you're not thinking of Mr. Beast, you're safe. Okay, next one I will do, name a YouTuber that's OG, or somebody that used to be on the platform a while ago been around for a bit okay as long as you didn't think of Jenna marbles you're good moving on okay next one let's do name a youtuber that is a female vlogger okay got it as long as you didn't just think of Emma Chamberlain you're good it's like who wants to be a millionaire next question round four and if you did, if, okay, and be honest. If you're out, you're out. Okay, honor system. Okay, next one. This is number four. It's getting a little more specific here. Name a YouTuber that made music. YouTuber that made music, okay? Think of somebody in your head. Give me a second. How about Gabby Hanna? The Gabby Show. If you didn't say that, you're still in here. 
Congrats. Final question. Also, I'm sorry if I'm sounding dramatic. I just, I've always wanted to be a game show host. Okay. This makes me feel like one. Okay, last but not least, name a gaming YouTuber that has over a million subscribers. This one a little bit more specific here. It's the last one. If you made it this far, congrats. And as long as you didn't just think of Markiplier, you won. Congrats. I feel like nobody who follows me probably cares of these, uh, but I, I could make a hundred of these, so you let me know. And if you won, congrats. I hope you have great luck today. Avoid saying the same thing as me, general knowledge. Okay, starting off, think of any country in Europe. Any country, anywhere in Europe. Just don't think of the same country as me, and I'll be very happy. Are you ready? Three, two, one, Germany. Hopefully I didn't get you out there. I definitely got at least one person out though. Okay, and for our next one, I want you to think of a US city. Any US city, anywhere in the US, obviously. <laughs> Just don't think of the same one as me. You got it in your head? Three, two, one, Phoenix, Arizona. I know at least one American from Phoenix. Uh, I just got out, so I'm happy about that. Okay, and for our next one, I want you to think of a sport. And also, I want you to follow while you're thinking of the sport. Any sport in the entire world, just not the same one as me. Okay, three, two, one, badminton. I, I, I know at least one person got out there because that's like a meme on TikTok. Okay, and for our next one, I want you to think of any color. Any color in the entire world. Just, again, try to avoid saying the one I'm thinking of. You've got the color in your head? Three, two, one, pink. Hopefully I got you out there. And for our last one, I want you to think of an Asian country. Any Asian country, again, just try not to get out. Hopefully you guys haven't got out yet. Are you ready? You got it in your head? Three, two, one, North Korea. Let me know in the comments if you guys survived and if you want to see more videos like this. Try and avoid saying the same answer as me. I'm going to ask you all five questions. If you get through all five and say a different answer to me on each one, then you win. If you say the same answer as me, then you lose. Up first, name me any breed of dog. Give you a few seconds. For everyone that said poodle, you're gone. Next up, name me any US states. Any of them. There's 50. Just pick one. But if you picked Oregon, bye bye. Name me any football team that plays in League 2, League 1, Championship or the Premier League. You've got 92 to choose from. And if you chose Sunderland, then you're out. Next up, I want a country beginning with the letter P. You could have had Poland, Portugal, Palau. But if you said Paraguay, then you're gone. And last but not least, you've got 12 months of the year. Name me one of them. If you said the month of October, you are out. Let me know how you did in the comments below. Who made it through? Who went out? Let me know. Avoid saying the same thing as me, UK edition. Come on, Shen. And if you get through all five things, uh, you, you, you win nothing, unfortunately. I'm sorry, lads. Maybe in the future. Okay, we're going to start off with name any city that is in England. All right, have a little think. What are we going to go for? Hmm, going to go with something that booms with an L. Will we go London? No, that's too obvious. If you've gone with Manny, you're out, mate. After round one, you're washed. Okay, next is any UK artist. Okay, and I don't mean like painting. I mean like a singer or a rapper or whatever. Okay, have, have a think. Is it going to be something really obvious? Yes, it is. We've gone with Dave. Really obvious one. If, if you picked that, what is your knowledge? You, did, you, didn't, you didn't try to change it up at all. Right, the next one is any supermarket that's in the UK. Do you know what I mean? What are you going to go for? If you picked Sainsbury's, you're out. Why, why are you picking Sainsbury's, mate? Sainsbury's is awful. I'm kidding. Sainsbury's isn't that bad, but Tesco's on top. You already know the rules. Right, at number four, we've got anyone that's in any UK soap. I'm only including EastEnders, Coronation Street. Hollyoaks just doesn't count, all right? So what are you going to go for? Are you going to go something obvious or something, something a bit more different this time? Go on, obvious again, Phil Mitchell from EastEnders. If you've gone with Phil Mitchell, you're out. Uh, you, you, you're out, to be fair, pretty late, but yeah, you're still out. And the final one, at number five, is any UK Prime Minister. What are you going to go for? It's the final one. Can, can you beat me? Can you win? If you picked David Cameron, you are out. 
Well done for anyone that p p Boris Johnson. You've somehow made it through there. But yeah, if you won, well done. If you didn't, better luck next time. But yeah, it a bit. Avoid saying the same thing as me, music edition. I'm hopping on this trend because all my other stuff flops anyways. So, but yeah, if you say the same thing as me, you're out. All right, first up, country singer. Any country singer, just name a country singer. All right, if you said Morgan Wallen, you are out. Number two, we got any Michael Jackson song. There's there's a lot out there, so don't don't overthink it. But any any Michael Jackson song. If he said Chicago, you're out. Number three, an artist or band that starts with the letter F. <clears throat> there's probably a couple out there, but there's only one in my mind, and that is Frank Ocean. If he said Frank Ocean. Get on out of here. Number four, any song from the 80s. Any song, you know, there's a lot out there, just any song. If you said everybody wants to rule the world, you're out. And last but not least, this is just gonna be down to luck. Name your favorite artist. If you have the same favorite artist as me, you're gone. All right, I have Steven Sanchez. So probably wasn't too popular, but if you got it, you're out. Can you avoid saying the same thing as me? Extreme edition. You guys wanted it to be harder, so I've made it harder. If you say the same thing, you are out. Okay, round number one. I want you to name me any country beginning with F. And there's only five of these in the whole entire world. So you've got to think carefully. The one I'm thinking of is Fiji. If you said Fiji, you are out. Round number two. I want you to think of any celebrity with the first name David. Again, there's a few of these, but there's not too many. Uh, the one I'm thinking of is David Tennant. If you said David Tennant, you are out. Round number three. I want you to think of any colour of the rainbow. Again, there's only seven colours of the rainbow. So again, you've got to think carefully. The one I'm going with is blue. Just simple blue. If you said blue, you're out. Round number four. I want you to name any planet in our solar system. It's as simple as that. Any planet in our solar system. The one I'm thinking of is Mercury. If you said Mercury... You are out. And round number five, this is an extremely hard round. If you got here, congratulations. I just want you to name me any number between one and three. The one I'm going with is number one. Let me know how you did in the comments.